Hello everybody, how's it going? Go Rex and I bring you another video. So, as you guys may have known the last few days, I've been speaking to a rioter known as Riot Maple. Uh, thanks to RTO, he actually got me to speak to him about Renekton related things. And while Renekton didn't have the WR interaction, I managed to talk to um, Riot Maple and just like try and give him details on like what's going on and all that stuff. What's um, intended, what isn't intended, all, all stuff like that. Um, so yeah, I'll, along with the talk, I talked about like many different things like animation cancels, bug fixes. And I did question if they had anything else um, planned for Renekton in the future. Well, not all my questions were asked, but I did give um, Riot a lot of context about how Renekton works. And I do think it's um, a step in the right direction to where Riot won't mess with Renekton for no reason unless, you know, something happens. And in the future, when they do look back at all these councils and stuff, they will know that what's uh, natural and what isn't natural. Uh, but yeah, anyways, it only took like two days for Renekton to get hot fixed, which, you know, it was fine. I wouldn't mind if they took like a whole patch, honestly, like if they did fix other stuff. But, you know, I'm very happy with the result overall. We got our WRE animation council back, but also they have changed a lot of things on Renekton that... A lot of people don't, probably won't even realize. I mean, you'll realize it if you're a good Renekton player, but the average Renekton player or, like, you know, the the average player won't really know, uh, tell, like, what's going on with Renekton and all shit like that. Uh, but anyways. So, Riot also bug-fixed the EQW bug as well. I, I um, So, as I was saying, I talked to Riot about a bunch of bugs. I talked about the E bug, where your um, E wouldn't hit certain targets. The uh, Q bug, where... Um, if you dash over a wall, in fact, I'll do it really quickly to show you guys an example. Actually, did they fix it? Hey, they might have fixed it, actually. I think they fixed it, actually. Hold on. Okay, it looks like they fixed the bug. So, there was a bug where, um... If you, um... EQ'd over a wall, your Q would not do any damage, like, as soon as you, um go over but it looks like they fixed that so because they fixed this that also might have something to do with the new q interaction on renekton which i'll show you guys shortly uh but that's um nice to know that that bug's fixed too i didn't even i didn't even realize that among all the testing that i was doing the last few days on renekton uh, but anyways let's get to the new uh changes on renekton then so they also removed rune cancel so the whole reason why riot did this was because um conqueror could cancel your um w animation so if you did like W then E with Conqueror um, active or like available before five stacks, you'd cancel the animation. Now this worked with Aftershock, um, Old Conqueror, Klepto, like on the activation proc, uh, Sun Impact, which is the one I used a lot. So you would um, W Flashy with Sun Impact available and you'd instantly cancel your W. Uh, but yeah, because of all these changes too, these are sadly not come back. Um, although I knew it was inevitable that they would eventually disappear or like get removed from the game. I'm not exactly, you know, salty about it because we actually got a lot of new things like uh, I've been saying like all video <laughs> so far. Yeah, let me show, let me, um, show you guys what I mean now. So, WR works as before. Now there is a weird interaction with Tiamat too. For some reason when I'm doing this combo now with Tiamat... It's a little delayed, like, you can see it there. Like, you'll notice it too if you, um... If you're a really good player on Renekton, like, and you know how to animation cancel. There is, like, a slight delay when you are doing this combo. I did it then, but my tier mat's not going off either, so... I feel like Riot still have... They haven't, like, reverted the W. But they have made a change to where, um... It has affected tier mat still. Like, even when you're Wing, like... Before you could, like, click out of it slightly. You can't even do it now. Like, before, um... Well, after this patch. So yeah, like the changes still remain, but Riot have allowed it so uh, you can cancel uh, with your R. So, you know, that that's something. I don't mind that. Either way, like, it, it's not exactly game-breaking, just R. And, you know, it's normal. But what they also changed, like, as I was talking about with the R and, like, W, R does completely cancel your W now, which it used to in the past before the Season 6 changes, where they, like, tried to fix Renekton's W from being able, well... For players like not being able to flash out of it or um blink out of it so say you went to w a target you're in your animation they like flash away and you you deal zero damage 
a nice escape without being CC'd and your W goes on cooldown. Or if you Q'd then W'd, you would um, go on cooldown. But yeah, that was fixed back then. But it also did like make reacting in a clunky state, which they did try and revert, but also they didn't really recover some old cancels that were available back then. Uh, but now they have changed also. Some cancels are actually back, as I show you now, like... WRQ works now. This used to work in the past, like I said, but that was removed. But luckily, you can do it again now, which is awesome. Although, if you try and WRT him at Q, it is a bit slow, as you can see. So, like the W Tim interaction, I don't know what's going on here, but it is like a, re a really um, weird thing that I can't exactly explain. But I don't think it really hurts Renekton much because like with the new combos and stuff that Renekton can do, uh, it makes things easier. Anyways, on to the next thing. So we got WQ, WRE, and now with the Q changes, the, the big changes like compared to the other ones. So if you Q now, and like if you EQ now, Renekton does, does this weird thing where he uh, just stands still. Like when you Q cancel sometimes on Renekton, You'll have moments where you cancel your auto attack and then you look like this. That's exactly what's happening now without me actually auto attacking. So what this means is there's like a bunch of new combos because they did fix Q, which is probably how they fix this bug actually. So I guess that's the reasoning why it, it works like it does now. Anyways, we can do combos like this. You can EQ. Okay, I'm not exactly doing it like I want to. There we go. So we can do shit like that now. We don't have to like Q cancel to like get away. We can do like a quick combo like this. Okay, I'm really bad at this. <laughs> you gotta try and like E over a target, then Q as soon as you get out, and then you do this. And sometimes you spin out of your uh, like you're doing your Q while you're um, Eing back. Well, not exactly, but the animation still looks like that, which is pretty funny and interesting. Uh, the next thing is... Oh yeah, you can Q cancel easier now. As you've seen then. It's a lot smoother like when the Q comes out. See, he doesn't like complete the full animation, I don't think. I mean, you can still mess it up like I'm doing right now. Because I'm really bad. And I've just like... It's my first game of the day, technically. <laughs> Actually, what's uh, the time in this recording? Okay, I'm like rambling on too much. I should just get down to like what this video actually is about. <laughs> Yeah, I'm reading off a list at the moment because like, there's a bunch of changes that I do want to like just talk about. I'll probably um, timestamp all this just so you guys can like skip the, through the video and all, all that type of stuff. Uh, anyways, so we can Q cancel easier now, which is uh, pretty cool. Except for that I'm failing at the moment. Obviously, with more attack speed, the easier it does become. So just keep in mind that I'm pretty low level right now. And the more attack speed that I will have, it will increase the overall speed. Although, it is more noticeable now that you don't need um, attack speed to like do a perfect cancel like that. So it is a lot easier. Anyways, so we can also EQW now. Now, before when we did this combo, as I was talking about earlier, it would actually bug you out. So before, you would look like this if you did it. And then you'd like stun. And sometimes in like worse cases, you would like EQW. You stay here for five seconds and then you'd like hit. But now that's fixed, and we won't get bugged out from it. So we can do combos like this. Now, this is a Panther combo, or a Q-Cancel combo, but with W. So this does lead to, like, a lot more interesting combos, like matchups like against Darius, uh, or other ranged champions. So it gives us another way of, like, being able to deal with them. I'm messing up on some of these because I'm still relatively new, like, trying to learn all these cancels, so... Bear with me. But yeah, that's the new uh, Panther combo with W. There's all, we can also cancel our Q of R now, too. But I'll just show you really quickly. Okay, that was that was not what I wanted to do. So, it looks like that, though. The reason why this works is because, like I was talking about just, when you, you'll do this, so as soon as you come out, you pretty much cancelled your animation. Like, kind of. If you like E. So, like, right after you do that, you can just, like, use your R and, like, get out that mini stun lock. 
yeah, leads to more interesting combos, and you can do a lot more in different situations, which, overall, that's what I really like about these cancels, like, it gives Renekton more freedom in situations. There also, there also is another cancel. Uh, before we, okay, so if you guys knew the Titanic cancel before, where you would, um, auto Q Titanic, it's kind of like that, but we don't need Titanic now, we just have to, like, click on the ground, but to show you guys really quickly. So it is auto attack QW, so we go like this. Oops. Now it looks slow, but you can make this go faster, but I'm really like bad at doing this at the moment. So it should look like that there. You gotta like try and click on the ground as soon as you AQ. Like that. So I did like auto attack Q, I clicked on the ground and W'd. So you, you can do that now. So that's good in a situation where you're running away from your enemy, you're low HP. Perhaps you need like to just do that combo to get 50 fury for your empowered W. That can help you um, finish your enemy off, then like you can just probably kill him off that. So again, it's sort of a situational thing you can do on Renekton. So, you know, if you're really good at cancelling or stuff like that, you've got like, you know. If you know you're shot on Renekton, that's pretty good to do. Now, there is another fun one, if I just get this really quickly. Where is it? It's a fun one that I like. And most of the guys that uh, know me. So, before, like, I made a video, like, of animation cancels. I did have Pro Belt in the video, and now, what you can do is, as well, you can do this. Before, when you did this, you'd be locked in your animation, like, your Q animation fully, but now you can, like, just do this. And now what you can do is, like, you can just, like, auto-attack Q, walk back a little bit. Just so, like, you ensure you hit all your, um, pro belt shots. So that's a fun little cancel there, that you can do. Okay. I was reading on my list then. It said auto-attack QR, but that doesn't seem to, uh, do anything. Yeah, if you're wondering, QR does not work unless you E, so it's all about the E with the, um, the Q cancel, this combo. Now, I'll just demonstrate a few combos now, so I'm probably not going to talk. I'm just going to, like, make it so these just all show at different times. So, yeah, enjoy the rest of the video. Thank you very much for watching, and maybe, uh, you know, this does something for you. Uh, actually, before I do this, are Renekton's... So, someone might question me. Are these cancels broken on Renekton? Will this bring back a 7.9 Renekton all over again and create a 7.10 like patch to remove all these cancels? I don't think so because this is this is, this is like the the reason why this works is because these are bug fixes. They're not like patch 7.9 where Riot messed up on his W coding and made it so like you could cancel out with your QE uh, pro like you could do anything like even Titanic. You would auto attack. QW Titanic and Titanic would brag the animation completely, which he never did before. The only thing that's done in the past is R and Tiamat. Tiamat does not work still. It would be nice to have that back, but I feel like this is compensation. Uh, like having R, like WRQ and all that type of crap. And like these new cancels. Like that's compensation for removing rune cancels and like losing Tiamat. So I'm not exactly bothered about that, but yeah. I don't think these are broken. This just gives Renekton like a higher skill ceiling. Because Renekton could do more things now in situations if the player is good enough to do them. Now, the average player can probably Q cancel a lot easier now with how it works. So, yeah, that's a lot easier now. However, I don't feel like this exactly makes Renekton broken. If you pick the right champions like Kennen, Jace, Teemo, Quinn, Vayne, uh, even Tanks. Like, if you're just smart enough to play the scaling game and punish Renekton when he has no cooldowns, you can, like, you know, he'll be the same as always, like... You'll always get the same result. However, Renekton can do, like, this combo too, which is, you know, a bit strong. But why do that combo when you can just do um, EQ? Okay, I didn't do that properly then, but... Why not, why not just do that combo? Like, that combo's been around for ages too. Like, you get way more DPS. Like, you apply more damage overall than, like, EQ, W, E. And, like, you know, the Q cancel W. So yeah, I don't feel like much changes, but obviously, you know, you do have like new things you can do. And if you're like a worse player on Renekton, you can get away with this stuff, but 
yeah, it, it just depends on the level of the player, really. But I feel like this benefits like higher level, higher level Renekton players more than average players. So, yeah, that's just my thoughts on like the changes on like Renekton. If they like make him broken or not, I disagree. Like, if you just pick a counter champion, you should be fine. And if you play, if you play smart enough just to scale into the game, you can probably outscale Renekton. So yeah, that's, that's just my take on it. But anyways, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoy these combos I'll show you now uh, as a result of the new uh, changes. And I'll see you guys next time.